All right, guys. Hi. Today I'm here with Lava Bella, and I want to um, tell you and show you a little bit about her and do a review of what I like and what I don't like. Um, okay, so she comes with this cute little dress, and she has this little underwear. And if you turn her around, the underwear has these like cute little ruffles. Really cute. And um, she also comes with the headband that she has on. And she comes with her little lamy toy, a spoon, her pacifier, and her uh, bottle. So let's turn her on. So on the back, this is where you turn her on and she has low volume and high volume. And then she has an A and a B. A is for English and B is for French. So we're going to start her with the English. <laughs> so we're going to let her do her thing. I think her battery might be running low. Because my daughter does play with her a lot. <laughs> she babbles and babbles. And then she does get ticklish. Or her tummy. There we go. Now this is her, um, like I said, my daughter does play with her, so um, she's already learned how to talk a lot. Um, when I first got her, it was nothing but babble. Um, you couldn't understand what she was saying. So she's learned to talk. Eat, please. And she wants to eat, she says. And to get her to eat. <coughs> and get her. And um, she'll get full and You're she won't. Hungry. See, she's not hungry. No, thank you. So she's done. She'll tell you when she's done. And she also burps. I don't know if you can hear that, but she just burped. Um, and then she has her little lamb and you put that, her little yellow nose to her nose and she'll kiss it. Yeah, and whatever sound animal the lamb makes, she'll... <laughs> she knows what it is. <laughs> Birdie. <laughs> yeah, over her. <laughs> Peekaboo, she said. Peekaboo, and then um, her bottle. Uh. And she'll make little chirping sounds like she's sucking on a bottle. That, that one and then her pacifier and that's one thing I don't like about her is that she um, sometimes won't respond when I'm putting it or if she does respond she doesn't give me enough time to put it in her mouth let's see come on She won't give me time, so I have to shove it in there. 
I'm tickling at the same time. Sorry about that. I was touching her feet. When you touch her feet, she gets ticklish. So that's that. Yeah, I'm tickling her feet. <laughs> and then you can also hear her heartbeat if you put your hand. I don't know if you can hear it, but. I'm being very quiet so you can hear it. So um, that's one mode. And then I'm going to put her on the um, French. Let's go to French. That's new. She's never done that before where she just stops like that. That's I, I think it's the batteries. I'll change those. Okay, hi guys. We're back. I changed her battery. Um, so she is working great. So that's why you can tell that her battery's not working when she wakes up and then wakes up again. So and then um, in the process of changing her battery, I got her a little bit dirty. Um, so you're not supposed to wet this doll. You're supposed to take a damp towel or cloth and just wipe her. <laughs> I'm touching her feet so she gets ticklish. So I won't touch her feet. No, you want to tickle me? No, tickle me. Yeah. And um, her face is actually kind of like a rubbery. I'm going to pull it a little bit so you can see. So it's not like hard plastic. It's really rubbery. It's really nice. I like the way it feels. So that's something. I'm looking through the instructions because I read the whole book. And um, I, I want to make sure I'm getting everything that I think is important. And then she falls asleep, if you're playing with her and she falls asleep, there is a button on the back of her that you press it and it wakes her right up. This button right there. I'm tickling again, I'm sorry, I'm tickling. And then on another thing that I read was that um, she can actually say mama and papa. Okay, guys, so I switched her to Dada. I don't think she... She works fine when I turn the camera off, and then when I turn the camera on, she, like, freezes. I don't know, maybe she's camera shy. Anyways, um, I switched her to Dada, so I'm going to show you she says Dada. Dada, she said Dada. And if I want to switch her back to Mama, I have to hold the, the back button here until I hear the beep. And then I touch her right foot, and that's going to switch her back to Mama. Let's see. I I'm touching her feet. You can't see that on camera, but I'm touching her feet. There. Now she's back on Mama. So that's how you do that. And I already showed you how to burp her. And like I said, the more you play with her, um, she'll learn more words over time. Um, if you want her to go back into baby mo mode and babble mode, um, you have to hold her back button once. And once you hear the, um, the beep, adjust the language switch and release her back button. And then that will reset um, Lava Bella to baby mode. So that's that. And um, it looks like she's sleepy. So if you lay her down, I'm going to lay her down right now. And you can see that she's sleepy.
Take her a couple minutes to um, shut off. Okay, she's done. So I'm going to leave her in that position. I'm going to wake her up by pressing the back button there. Sit her up. She wants to eat. I'm not going to feed her, see if she cries. There, she started to cry. Now, if you want to calm her down, you just Pet her back and rub it, and she's gonna come right down. There it is. Okay, you wanna eat? Now you can eat. All right, so that's um everything that I um, I wanted to say about her um. The only thing, other thing I didn't say was her battery. She takes four of the C batteries. Um, so that's that. And then I'm going to go ahead and change her. So you guys can see. Um, the type of clothes she wears. I'm going to lay her down here. And um. I went to the uh, thrift store and I found this cute little sweater with these cute little pants. So she's going to wear this um, and this is a size newborn. And um, I have this uh, newborn onesie. This used to be my daughter's when she was a newborn. So I'm glad I kept some of her clothes. So put it in on her. other side now the clothes you really have to stretch it out because her arms do not bend at all so you cannot bend it so there's that and then um i'm gonna put a diaper on her and she wears uh, this is a preemie diaper and it does fit her pretty good Or here's the diaper and as you can see it fits her really good. Pants fit her pretty good. Let's try the sweater now. Like I said, her arms do not bend backwards at all, so I can't bend it. Just got stretched with the sweater. So here she is in her little um, newborn outfit. It fits her pretty good. I'll show you what she looks. She looks pants fit her perfect. Um, so that's it. That's my um review of her. Um, overall, I will recommend this doll. She is um, a lot of fun to play with. Uh, the only thing I would ask um, the company to change would be her pacifier that she doesn't read it that well. And um, it's really hard to get this one in and you're not even supposed to force her mouth open. That's what the um, instruction says that do not force anything in her mouth. Um, and then also that her arms that they would bend backwards so it's easier to um, get close on her that's another thing I would change but other than that everything works good other than the glitches I've been having with her which just started I don't know what maybe it's some um, cheap batteries I'll run to the store and get new ones um, so that's it
Thanks for watching, guys.